in this video, I'm gonna give you two tips that will help you stay on track with your diet during the holidays. Coming up next. We just had Thanksgiving, so I figure now is a really good time to talk about your diet because around this time of the year, people tend to fall off track with their diet. Saying things like, Damn it! The holidays ruined me! I can't believe how much weight I'm gaining! They always get the best of me the dang holidays! The holidays definitely contribute to eating extra tasty foods. However, was it the holidays that ruin your diet? Or was it anything that you did before the holiday season? Hmm. Time for lunch! Mmm. Oh yeah, about my diet! I'll start again on Monday. It's Wednesday, I've got plenty of time to think about healthy decisions between now and then. So, I'm gonna enjoy this. The holiday shouldn't be seen as a threat to your diet. Hell, I'm all about enjoying tasty food, drinks, and desserts with your friends and families during this special season. Merry Christmas, babe. Merry Christmas to you, too. Oh my God, this pie looks so good. Yeah. Let's eat. Hell, being around your family, you might need a drink when they start interrogating you about your life, asking you questions like, By the way, Jan, when are you going to give me grandchildren? Yeah, we're getting older and we want some grandchildren. Is there any more of that wine anywhere? Here are my tips for dieting during the holidays. Tip number one, make sure you're actually following a nutrition plan or diet. Oftentimes people start and stop and start and stop their diets and that'll look something like this They'll begin a diet on a Monday They'll maybe they'll have some kind of idea in their head about what they're supposed to eat But then Tuesday rolls around and someone shows up with tacos in the office and you're not supposed to eat that or maybe it's something else some other kind of Sweet food that you like or salty food something that tempts you and at first you kind of say oh, I'm not gonna eat that but then you do it anyways and then what happens is you say to yourself, okay, I'll start the diet over on next Monday, right? And you keep pushing it off. So maybe you'll do it for a few days, you'll be kind of good, and then you'll start up again. And the, the problem with this is that if you're starting and stopping and starting and stopping, it can make you feel like you're actually dieting. So literally, because you've started and stopped so, so many times, you confuse yourself into thinking you've been dieting for a really long time, when in reality, you just started and stopped and started and stopped a bunch of times and you were barely dieting. So you aren't really losing weight. Here's my recommendation. Actually start a diet and stick to it during this season and when you get to Christmas dinner or let's say it was Thanksgiving, we just had Thanksgiving, but let's say it was Thanksgiving or Halloween or New Year's with drinks. Whatever the case might be, if you've been dieting correctly, that day you can eat what you want during that meal because that will be your cheat meal. You won't need to feel like you're breaking your diet or like you're not on, the, on track with your nutrition because you've been on track every step of the way. This is just a cheat meal. You can eat that completely guilt free. Tip number two. Go back to dieting the moment the holiday is over. And that is two or three months where you're just saying, ah, I'm just gonna wait till New Year's to get on back on with my diet. After Christmas Eve or Thanksgiving dinner or Christmas Day dinner, give away the unhealthy foods. Uh, give it to your friends, your family, don't eat them. Eat the things that are a little bit healthier and get back on track with eating healthy until the next holiday. And when New Year's rolls around and you wanna have that extra piece of food or that extra cake or whatever it is that you like to have, drinks, whatever it is on New Year's Eve, you can enjoy that completely guilt-free because you've been dieting each and every step of the way. All right, people, question of the day. What are you doing to stay on track with your diet during the holidays? 
If you have any tips or tricks that I didn't cover, please leave them down in the comment section below. Also, if you'd like to receive more videos like this, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you're on Facebook, like or share this with your friends. Until next time, peace.